welcome back to Let's Play SCP Containment Breach. Sorry, I was just looking closely at that picture. It didn't dawn on me that was 173. Uh, animate and extremely hostile. I can't imagine why. Let's crack it open and see what's inside. Why don't I just get a sledgehammer? We can't assume that, well, it might react like a weeping angel and just regenerate itself if we leave it alone long enough. <laughs> that statement right there, though, as long as in direct line of sight, is actually... Well, it's true to the SCP lore, but not true to the way that it works in the game. In the game, as long as you're looking in its direction, it doesn't matter if it's through walls, it doesn't move. Now, part of that is because if you have it move as soon as it leaves the player's line of sight, there's two problems there. One, it is more complicated to program a game to dynamically figure out where your exact line of sight is and take into account walls and solid objects. Two, it would make it a lot harder to evade it and cause it to appear to creep around doorways and turns as you as it moves slightly out of reach it would jump into reach and appear to be slowly moving around turns which would well it wouldn't really look right in the game it would actually be realistic but it's one of those things that would just look a little odd but I don't know what that noise was and I don't want to know um, Okay, this time we're going into the entrance zone. Okay, so I'm gonna try to just check that once in a while. There's a thing, nothing on that. 173 is nowhere to be seen, and I like to keep it that way. I hear sounds that are making me quite uncomfortable. Um. Ugh, there's always that unnerving, because it's an area I've not been to, so I'm a bit creeped out. I don't know what's up with this red room. Although, I really like that they named them the Nine-Tailed Fox. Control the Nine-Tailed Fox. Tizzle gate disabled. Okay. I don't know if they show up on radar, either. Trying to move very cautiously because I don't know. Oh, 173 is in here. Dang it. I don't think it's noticed me yet, though, so I'm going to leave it be. And it can just stay down there. 066. I'm not familiar with that number. I want to go up there, but I also want to see what 066 is. Am I going to regret this decision? Probably so. What the? What are you? Oh, I recognize that from the loading screen. Oh, 
What the heck was that? So it just has a really weird disorienting effect. One seven three has moved up there. One seven three, you can stay that. Oh crud! It's it's trying to get through the door. gonna leave it that way. Maybe I'll be lucky and it'll find the uh, the, uh, the nine-tailed fox guys. I'm gonna go ahead and seal myself in here also. 173 cannot open keycard doors. So that's that's nice. What is that? SCP-420-J? <laughs> I'm assuming that was a drug. Also, a oh, radio. Let's see. Nuclear device document? <laughs> Oh, I've already got that. that. I guess that's all, if I haven't already found it. I've already got plenty of key cards. <laughs> okay, that's kind of funny. I don't know why that's labeled as an SCP, though. They want all of it for themselves. Okay, 173 is that away. And 066 can stay put. I've lost 173. Uh, I think that's about everything in here. That's somebody's office. Okay, 173 has moved. I know not to where, but I'm going to take advantage of it. I really want to explore down here, as long as Eric don't mess with I mean, I know it's not, its name's not Eric. A cup! Ah! Yes. Requesting anything other than human beverages. Uh, S. No, no, no. How do I, how do I enter it? Couple of Estus. Ha ha. Will this heal me? <sighs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody told me there was a Dark Souls reference there. What happens if... Lava. I think I broke the machine. This is going to be a very bad decision. <laughs> that was a very bad decision indeed. I didn't think you'd be don't know. Found dead with the thing. Ooh. Fourth degree burns, traces of... They actually wrote a scenario for that. The styrofoam cup was located. <laughs> oh. Don't drink the lava. That's my, uh, that's, that's my pearl of wisdom. Don't drink lava. Hmm. 
Okay, so... Assuming that nobody's nearby... Oh, 066 is over there, but he can stay put over there. Uh... Let's see... Anti-matter... Will this work? That noise worries me. Well, <laughs> I don't think that helped. <laughs> I don't think it killed me either. I broke the game. Yeah, jump cut. You know, I love how the all the text for 066 makes no mention of the hack that has eyeballs sticking out of it. Uh, let's try... I did look some of these up uh, during, the, during the break, while the jump cut thing. Fourth wall. What the? This is me. I don't exist. But you do. You can help me. Uh, let's see. What else? Aqua... Regia. Let's see if I spelled that right. Should be more cuprite. Hmm, and he won't drink it either. Let's see, amnesia. And yes, both of these are fairly. Uh, well, I was gonna say fairly obvious reference, but not really obvious. Can't really call that game obvious. Aquaragia and amnesia drink are both reference to uh, amnesia. Daniel, is that you? What are you doing? What, what is that over there? Oh, that's the Aqua Regia. Uh, what else? Life. And like I said, the Estus was a uh, reference to Dark Souls, the Estus Flasks. Life is, uh, I'm gonna be honest, life is basically red pill. Let me go ahead and drop that. Um, ooh, I know one. Spoilers. Cup of spoilers. I'm gonna go ahead and be honest, uh, judging by the list of things that this thing will give out, there are some very disturbing ones that you will not be seeing me type. A couple of spoilers. Sir, we found a dead Class D on the walkway outside Gate B. He's got multiple gunshot wounds in his chest. I'd assume he was shot when we were fighting SCP-682. I'd like to know how the hell did a Class D get past the gate? Deliver me the security tapes from all the cameras near the gate and find out who was stationed there before and during 682's escape attempt. That, sir. Go away, cup. <laughs> so many cups. <sighs> Try. Well, that's 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 work. Oh, I thought that might be a document I could pick up. I guess they just have somebody monitoring this machine all day. Oh, I know one that I forgot.
I'm not even joking. <sighs> it uh, gives you 15 seconds of invincibility. This one is supposedly a reference to Elder Scrolls, and will give you 100 seconds of invincibility, so I'm gonna hang on to that. Uh, I really, really would like to get more cups of life, just because, you know, having red pills is nice. I'm actually gonna go ahead and cut this one here. Uh, it ended up being a little over 30 minutes, so I divided it in half and added this in post. But I'm going to go ahead and pause here, and I will see you next time.